week. I was a bit frustrated because of planning, getting people here. Uh, my immediate family is in Johannesburg, so they had to fly in. My mother is here, my brother, my niece is also here, and also some of my friends are here. But coming up to today, it's been really exciting and you know overwhelming in a, in a really, really good way. Just to think about, I only have one step to go to the red gown. It just makes me feel like, you know, I'm moving, I'm, I'm doing something, you know, I'm, I'm not just stagnant and in one place because with starting further and with post-grad, I don't really take a break to work. So you kind of feel like, mm, I've been in school for too long, but graduating and taking moments to celebrate this makes you feel like, you know, I'm, I'm actually getting there slowly and surely. I am from Venda. I'm re representing the Venda people. So this is a Venda traditional attire. I decided to wear this just to represent where I'm from um, and also my um, grandmother. It's her birthday today, um, but she's late now, so I wanted her to be here. But wearing this kind of represents where I'm from and who she is. So my surname is Mudao, which kind of means a female lion that is a king. So it means we are very strong, powerful, educated, independent women. So me wearing this makes me feel like I'm representing her and I'm honoring her in some way. So these are vendor traditional um, beads. Usually they're supposed to be way more than this, but I'm wearing about 50 and I think 75 on each. And then this is a Mwenda. This is worn by young women, young unmarried women. And then um, this is also a young women's skirt. So young um, adult women, but not really married. And then this is called um, Rutomaratie. And when you translate it, it means to pick your eyelashes. I don't know why it was called that, but I think it's a way to represent, to make you feel like you look really stunning to a point where you don't really need lashes. So that's, this is what it means, yeah. So... For also to the tradition, the culture, the vendor people. 